history of the waters off Palm Beach also happens to be a rare treat for local divers. We caught up with a group that spent Sunday exploring wreckage from a plane that crashed years ago. As Aaron Guy tells us, this urban legend is all too familiar for people who go boating or diving near the site of this crash. Here at Deep Six Dive and Water Sports, every weekend they suit up and they head out for a dive. They never know what they're going to find, but they usually see interesting fish. Every once in a while they'll see a shipwreck, but it's very rare that they run across a plane wreck. You can tell it's upside down by looking for the landing gear. It's not every day that dive instructor Stephen Wood gets to take a selfie with a plane that's crashed in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean, roughly 125 feet below the surface. So this is just off of um, the Palm Beach Island, just south of the Breakers Hotel. Wood always thought the story behind the plane was that it crashed, only one person survived, and then they dragged it out and let it sink to the bottom. But as stories go, there's always more than one version. But I did hear an urban legend recently from one of the captains of Narcosis dive charters. Um, he said that there was a guy that was trying to flee the country with a bunch of money. And uh, it crashed shortly after takeoff and that no one ever recovered the bag of money. I have an urban legend. I don't know how true it is, but it sounds pretty cool. A rare experience. It's kind of unique to get the opportunity to dive it. The plane is still fully intact and upside down. Plenty of crevices for creatures to lurk. There, there was um, a whole bunch of tomtail fish uh, covering. You can see a few of them here. But that's really all they saw. Fish inside the wreckage. But who knows? There could be treasures somewhere hidden inside. Nobody's found the bag yet, supposedly. So, no, so far, no money yet. Well, if you want to see more of this dive and all the other adventures that they have here at Deep Six Dive and Water Sport, we have a link on our website, WPBF.com. In Stewart, Aaron Guy, WPBF 25 News.